Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. If you have never seen my face before, hello, my name is Emma. Welcome to this little beautiful universe that I'm creating, community, whatever you want to call it. And if you are a reoccurring watcher, hello, thank you for coming back. I know it's been forever, but I am back and I feel better than ever and ready to take this Instagram where, not Instagram, this YouTube channel to where I wanted to go. I wanted to just give you a little update about who I am. For a lot of people, you might be new here, never seen this channel before, so I wanna just talk a little bit about myself and then what I have been up to for the past year, all the life changes that has been going on in my life, and then where I'm seeing this channel move into and what I'm gonna talk about on this channel and all the fun things that I have planned for us to do together. So, let's get into it. also Norway. Grew up, had my insecurities, and a lot of these things pointed to authenticity. So being afraid of being myself. And I had always heard like, oh you're too much, uh, I got bullied from a few boys in my middle school because I took up too much space, so I've always been like uncomfortable with all of me. I found spirituality in 2021 that's two years ago now and it was because of a or three incidents where I was sexually taken advantage of I have already talked about all of that on my podcast and I can link it down below but that kind of changed the whole trajectory of my life and ever since that I have been getting to so much healing work, really getting to the root of why these things kept happening to me. And I have put so much effort and money into my personal growth. And I've learned a lot on the way, and I'm still learning. I'm still pretty far from where I know I can go, but you know, with everything that has happened to me, I know that it can only get better and I'm getting stronger and stronger every day so yeah I love human design I love astrology um, I love painting sewing very creative and that is also a big part of who I've always been I've always been creative since I was a little girl and for the past year which I'm gonna talk about in this next part but for the past year I have just stopped doing anything creative and only focused on my business and that has not taken me as far as I would have wanted to so I am getting back into that and really sharing the whole getting back into your creative juices and yeah stuff like that so I'm gonna be talking more about that in the next few parts let's move on to what this past life has looked like for me because it has been insane <laughs> So when you 
you last saw me post a video, I was living at home at my mom's place. I had just moved back, going to a opening of Fluke Skapverkstedt. And since that, I've been a part of Fluke, been a part of their crew. And that was kind of like my whole welcome back to Oslo. And it was so great because I actually found people that felt like home. People that were different, people that really dared to be who they truly were and it was so great finding that kind of people in Oslo where I never really felt at home. Since then I moved in with my friend from high school and through her I met my boyfriend of now five months and that has also been such a big learning curve meeting him and really getting into what it's like being in a healthy relationship because i've never been in a healthy relationship before until this i was in five relationships in three years before i moved to new york so from 27 no two years 2017 to 2019 and since then i had just been trying to find the person that i wanted to spend the rest of my life with because that's where I'm at in my life, even though I'm only 22 years old. And I have found him. He appeared in my living room. I have a podcast about that too, that I can link in the description on how we met and what I did to meet him. I have also found a part-time job, two part-time jobs actually. And now I am figuring out where I want to take this next iteration of my life, figuring out what I want to do, how I want to spend my time, getting back into my creativity, and yeah, that is what this YouTube channel is all about, sharing that with you guys and sharing my journey. Let's talk about where I am taking this podcast, not podcast, where I am taking this YouTube channel, what we're going to talk about, and why I'm doing this again. I have been through so much in the past few years, like I said, and one of the things that I have really missed is sharing it with you guys in a very authentic, vulnerable way. And for me, YouTube is that. YouTube is how I can share my progress, how I can share more of my personality, and really just get more personable with you guys, get deeper, really share a part of me that I haven't really been able to share without this. I got a wasp. So I'm gonna talk about love and relationship. I'm gonna take you on my travels we're gonna talk about solo dating and finding a deeper connection to self we're gonna talk about true authenticity how you can find your own true authentic style i'm gonna share more of my fashion tips and just have more fun creating fashion videos i'm gonna talk about feminine energy and how to cultivate a more feminine lifestyle combining femininity and masculinity to for the, for the masculine to support the feminine and for you to be able to, if you identify as a woman, for you to be able to lean more back and trust in the universe and the timing of things. I'm going to talk about joy, how to cultivate more joy in your life, really finding that community, the people that you truly desire to be around. I'm going to talk about cultivating more confidence also through clothing how that can make you feel more confident and i'm going to share about things that i learned on the way and a little bit of my life here in oslo it's going to be a ride and i am so excited to take you guys with me on this journey i would love it if you subscribe to my channel give this video a like comment down below what you want to see from me i would love to hear yeah, turn that notification bell on so you don't miss any of my future videos.
thank you guys so so much for watching my first video back and i will talk to you guys in my next one bye